Hey guys, it's Moonfell, and it's time for some more Subnautica. I have quite the list of things to do today. Let's just go ahead and do our standard bit. We got a base tour. We actually have two base tours. I did a lot of work off screen. Uh, we need to go check out the mushroom forest, get our last Cyclops holes piece, and maybe, if we're lucky, we'll make a Cyclops, and then we'll go find the grapple arms pieces. Grappling arm pieces for the prawn suit. I got this fresh cut and I'm ready to go, you know? So let's do that. I'm very excited to play this game some more. I like want to play it a lot more than I get to. <laughs> I did some work. <laughs> uh, which is immediately apparent from this amazing bedroom I've created for myself. So we have our aquarium here. We have a very large uh, creature containment in which I have put some creature eggs that I found while I was co collecting uh, all the stuff I needed for this and all the things. Um, so here's the second level. And uh, yeah, we've got some stalkers and some sand sharks and a bone shark. I think that's the only bone shark I have. And a crash fish and, you know, just all kinds of stuff. It's all kinds of stuff. Now, I don't know if you remember. This used to be the entrance. And, uh, I made it to a, a deeper part of the ocean than I've been in yet. Just, 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 just barely while I was, uh, gathering stuff. And I got some of those. Sorry. <laughs> but I didn't, I didn't make the stuff with them yet. So we can still do that together. But yeah, I, I increased our food amount, food production. I got us one of these for down here. And I made us some, some storage. So that's this base. This is the, uh, this is the, the nose base, as it were. And then we'll just go hang out or go head to the, uh, to the Welcome Ruby base. The and look at, look at all the work I did there. I cannot tell you how much time I spent gathering stuff and making my bases look different. Some might argue too much time. I was just feeling, uh, productive, I guess. Mostly I was feeling like I couldn't stop once I started. was like, I'm going to redo this. And then I was like, I'm going to redo this. <laughs> and I just could not stop myself from continuing to do way too much. We did a very similar thing over here that I did some of the bedroom in the other place. Oh, also. While I'm at it. These guys. Are uh, ones I raised from, from eggs. That's why they're just, like, here in this place they're definitely not supposed to be in. <laughs> I have too many. So if you have more than one of an egg that you hatch, they will make more. And then you will have too many, like I already have again. I don't need you or the you or you. So yeah, you'll just end up with way too many things. So Okay, now we're here. I didn't really do too much here. I did get us another one of these. I moved this one away from the wall a little bit. That was just for me. Um, yeah, really over here didn't do too much other than other than my tall rooms, which I think look really nice. But did I do the thing where I made it where I can even get in up here? Yeah, I did. It's not quite as cute as my other one because my other one has like a top room or whatever, but it's still cute. Still cute. I'm asleep, so it's no longer dark. Hopefully, uh, and then we will head over to the mushroom forest. Meow. And we'll do most of our uh, building. I mean, because the cyclops just takes a lot of materials. Um, but I did gather a whole bunch of materials with, with the hope that I wouldn't have to do much gathering between getting that last fragment and building it. So hopefully, this will be a quick little jaunt. That would have been a lot quicker in not this lovely piece of equipment here. So this part of the red, uh, the plains or whatever, should dump right into the mushroom forest, which is where we're heading. Get ourselves a cyclops hole, hopefully, probably, maybe. Okay, hopefully I'm not wrong and I haven't just wandered into, oh, nope, they're there. Here they are. There is a leviathan up there that we're gonna avoid. Go away. 
find somewhere else to be my friend. Now I just need to keep an eye out for a Cyclops hole and not go too far that way because we don't want to. Um, ooh. and oh, uh, I don't think that's a Cyclops hole, but maybe you never know. You never know. <laughs> oh, holy shit! Holy shit! Okay, let's talk about the Cyclops. We should talk about us and one of them shot. One of them dare Cyclopses. Three enamel glass. Three plasteel. A little less. But everything else? What is that? Lid? I just picked up one of those. Advanced wiring kits. That's doable. Alright. Should have just brought the damn sea moth. Thought I was gonna have more trouble in that. Apparently not. I'm just gonna go right back to the base. So we need 30 titanium. Six lithium. I have a whole, I think I have almost an entire box folder <laughs> of uh, lithium. So I think that's gonna be no problem whatsoever. Whatsoever. Oh, I'm gonna pick up a couple of those. Those are these guys' eggs. And I just would like them, you know? Just as a person, would like some more of these guys because they're delightful. Woo! I did some work, y'all. I just need you all to know. I did some work. Boy, I made so many of these over here. Also, they look just awful. Like, right? Anyway, so I need one gold, two silver, and a salt. Hey, you, AG. One gold, two silver, and a salt. And um, salt. Oh, you know, I'll just take it from here. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna go put these creature eggs in over here, and then we will create our stuff. And we'll make our sea moth, which is a little bit far away at the moment. It's fine. Boop, boop, boop. Meep, 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 meep. Get us some more gastropods in there, because I think that even though they're very lumpy, I think they're very cute. Not as cute as cuttlefish or hooverfish, which, by the way, where'd my... Oh, I put I put him, and I got some friends for him up here. That's what I did. Forgot for a second. I was like, where's my hooverfish? I forgot. I made, I made him some friends. Look at how cute they are. Who gave you permission to be so dang- Oh, <gasps> cute. Hi. Just flipping around there. Anyway, uh, part of the problem with me in this game is I can just sit here and look at the fishies. <laughs> and I'm gonna make the stuff for my sea moth. This uh, perimeter defense. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. I don't know if you're aware, but it's gonna be good. Uh, I need to make one of these too. I'm gonna go do that real fast so I have it. Sea moth. Here we I made the hydrochloric acid, but I didn't make the polyaniline. My beard. My beard. My beard. Polyaniline. Polyaniline. It just <laughs> occasionally <laughs> realize that I'm singing a thing that you're gonna make into a thing and uh, realize that I regret having sang it. And that makes me a little sad, you know? I don't regret singing being silly. And yet, I do. So let's do this. First of all, we got one of these, so we can take that off. And we can take that off and that off. I did some work, yo. I don't know if you noticed, but there's a little there. Where is the marker? Oh, ruby base. Stalker teeth! I made myself a stalker playground with about six pieces of uh, the metal. So, um, doesn't matter. Um, but I made myself a little stalker teeth generator over there. Super useful. Super useful. Okay, so I'm gonna need three of these. Two, three. Boop, boop. And I made some glass. Hell yeah. Three glass. Yeah. One more of these. Whoop, whoop. Um, and then uh, let me two silver and a gold and another gold, I think, for the... Hold on. 
Computer chip. Oh, it takes two. Wait, wait, wait. I need one more. God, I'm gonna have to freaking farm up some more gold. Balls. Okay. I don't need to do that right this second, though, so we should be good. We'll do a little FPB over here. Yeah. Wah. Okay, I've got two, and I'll need lithium. I will need two per, and there's three. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So let's start there. It's a lot. So, I'm gonna have to give me a second, I think, to get it all together. Let's just do, let's do this first. Let's make our glass. And then we'll make our leaded glass, and that will get a lot of our problems out of the way. And I can make copper wire, which means I can make my computer chip. And I can make my wiring kit. And then I can make my advanced wiring kit. I'm going to go put the silver away. I'm gonna break down the metal salvage I have, which is eight of them. I guess if I just completely fill up, I have 16 titanium. Cool. So I'll be able to Now I should be able to get enough for eh, hopefully enough for both. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh, flash one. Wait, is that the last one? No, we need two more. Okay, so I did get enough. And I got one extra titanium in there. What do you know? Oh, boy, all right. We're gonna just have us a little jaunt up here to my... Wait, where is it? What the frick? Oh, there it is. Just missed it for a second. Did you push my mobile vehicle bay? That'll be rude. That'll be rude, fine. Oh boy, all right. Be advised. To be operated by a three-person crew. Only experienced townspeople should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. Woo! <laughs> I'm excited. I am excited about a Cyclops. And terrified. But excited. <gasps> Look up my giant submarine Welcome to Captain. All systems online. <laughs> All right. Bodhi. Make boat face. Shit. How have I not thought of a Cyclops name? It's fine. Cyclops. But we are gonna do this, right? We have to do, it does have to do this. I'm so sorry for anyone who finds this obnoxious, but I will not not be this person. So let's go look at it. Hope you're ready. Ah, <laughs> I'm so happy. You think I'll get copyright struck if I'm saying that song? It feels like a, it feels like a bad one. It feels like one that I don't wanna, um, I don't wanna fuck around with. Fine. Sub Mary. Yellow Sub Mary. All right. Welcome to the Cyclops. Um, it has a vehicle bay. You can get an upgrade for the Cyclops where you can, you know, repair and charge your vehicles in the vehicle bay. However, these are the power cells for the Cyclops. The Cyclops has six power cells. And the part of the leader game is just. Making sure Engine powering up. that your power cells are full. <laughs> also, piloting, said Bodie McBoatface. A little bit difficult. A little bit hard to tell what's going on. It feels a little rough because you can't really see anything. Hey, look, there's the ground. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take a little time and make it face my base. That's what we're gonna do for right now, just so you can see. 
you looking at? Oh, I wasn't even close. I gotta go even further down. Woo! Okay, we can't go too far, because it's huge. But also it trucks, which is nice. But also, also, if you need there to be light, boy, does the Bodie McBoat face have that for you. Silent running. Okay, anyway. Um, so this is Cyclops. Uh, we have to navigate it into some tight spots later on. So get ready. Get ready for it. I did not need to leave the lights on. But you know what? I did. And so here we are. Um, so I'm going to grab. There is a an upgrade that I have for it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, that I found in the Aurora. Lucky me. <laughs> Uh, made right there engine efficiency module super nice super helpful let's look at our cyclops upgrades okay we have this one already that's really nice yeah most of the shit is gonna take us going a little deeper the shield generator is super cool however it just sucks your battery down so basically, I will make a little home away from home on the Cyclops. Uh, I can put a bed in there. I can put, I can put all kinds of stuff in there. And so I will do that uh, later so that I can live and not die when I have to take this yellow submarine places. Yellow sub Mary. What if we just take our little bronze suit here? Take our little friendly bronze suit here. Hop our happy butts right over into our submarine. Wow. Oh, I'm too far fucking forward. Are you kidding me? Oh, it did it. Backward. Also, not forward. I was back. It doesn't matter. I'm too far, but too far somewhere. So, Shawnee. Shawnee. Shawnee, baby. Where did you go? I let my chewed roses at your light. Oof. I should get more power cells. Ooh, I should do some work. And I think I'm gonna make a base. I'm trying to remember. I think that our best opening to get down into the the Lost River, which is our next zone that we have to go to, is gonna actually be out um, that way. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to it, but, but, <laughs> it should be fine, uh, but we're going to go out that way anyway, we're going to go towards the Life Pod 3, and then we're going to go towards the, uh, the floating islands, right? Engine right? Okay. Oh, it only goes 500 deep? That's going to be a problem. Oh, that's battery. Where's my hull? Oh, there it is. Duh. I knew that. <laughs> I can go faster. Uh, it's over there. But it'll catch fire if I do it for too long. Which is super cute. Oh, is that a big piece of copper? Gold! I was just gonna spend some time looking for you, my friend. Huh. What do you know? A little bit of AU. Stick in the old vault. I don't know what kind of person I'm channeling, but uh, I'm doing a pretty good job. But... I like my knees. Got a little chicken legs. This guy swims. <laughs> oh, look at there. Some more fucking gold. Oh my god. That guy might be a problem, though. I will punch you right in your stupid face. Okay, let's see what we got here. Hopefully we don't draw anything's attention. Oh, hello. I apparently did not have any more room. Whoops. You come back here. Wait, 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 excuse you. Excuse you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright. So we got a full tank over here. Got a, all the gold we can carry in just amount. Oh, hi, buddy. Wow. Eat it. 
<laughs> you want to fight again? I'll punch you in the damn face again. Next time, you know what we're going to do? We are going to go wreck diving again. Yay! We're going to go wreck diving and we're going to uh, find us a grapple arm for the prawn suit. Next time. We didn't have time for it today. So I'm just going to uh, go park this back uh, over by my lovely uh, nose base. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rename. I'm renaming this. It's not going to say home base anymore. It's going to say nose base because let's be honest. It's the nose base. You know what I mean. You know what I'm talking about when I say the nose base, right? Right. Let's not, let's not hit one of the Leviathan that live around here. It feels like that's probably far enough down. I do it every time. Get back into the piloting. Turn the engine off. And yeah. The next time I'm on here, uh, hopefully I have some like store more storage the, the cyclops does have storage it's down here and there's you know not very much of it there's a lot of room for more um you can put a lot in uh but yeah there's not a lot of space i think you can name these nope you can't i lied yeah next time i will i will uh give you a cyclops tour of the work i've done to make my cyclops hospitable and useful more useful it's already pretty goddamn useful and then we will prepare ourselves because in the near future, we're going to be down low enough that we will need another base. Hooray. <laughs> hooray, hooray, hooray. And if we have time, because I think we will, we will start exploring where we're going next and how we're going to get there, which is the, uh, we're going to have to figure out how to get to the Lost River. My, I'm going to cheat and use a map. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I'm going to cheat and use a map. Uh, I'm pretty sure I know, is it the blood kelp tent trenches? That's where the uh, Degasi base was. That really low one with the, with the oct octopods, octonauts, whatever they're called. Crab squids. There it is. They're crab squids. Yeah. So the crab squid uh, place uh, was also a blood kelp trench, but there's one just to the, uh, west of the Aurora. I say just the rest, west. It's past the mushroom forest that we just went through. Um, and past what else is out there? It's out there. There's a big opening to the, uh, to the Lost River down there. Which will probably be our next big thing. But there is also some ghost leviathan up there. There's one above up in the very top, tippity top of the, uh, the, uh, blood kelp trench. And then there's a, there's a ghost leviathan right as soon as you get into the, uh, Lost River, so. I'm gonna have a great time. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you all next time. Then we'll play some more Spotica. 